All right, guys, another disc detainer lock that's been in my queue not for very long. I actually bought this at the beginning of February in anticipation of this tool. Uh, this is the Kryptonite New U. That means it has the that evil Series 4 core that those Kryptonite engineers put together. We'll talk a little bit more about that, but it is it is quite special. They call this the CryptoLock Mini 7. It has a 1 half inch or 12.7 millimeter shackle. Some of the reviews of this thing, it's a 6 out of 10, are not too positive on Amazon. And they say that one side or the other, one side is actually locked and the other is not. Um, this is brand new. The keys are still in and I haven't even opened it up. But I'm going to trust that it works. Let's pick it and then take a look at this single bolt locking mechanism. They do say it is double deadbolt design for anti-twist, but all the reviews say... One or the other is not locked. Oh, just, just shoved through the body. Let's find out. Um, as I said, I kept the keys, but they're still wrapped up. Let's just see if we can't pick it open. That ought to be pretty close. See how awkward this is to hold. Okay, just slide that all the way in. We'll start in the back. And I'm going to pull this out to make sure I'm only snagging that first disc. Okay, Series 4, or New U as they call it here. That means that you can tension off of any disc, and I'm going to tension off the first disc, but only one of the discs will allow you to rotate the core once you get all the discs picked to the right gate. I don't know which one it is. It's always going to be a zero, uh, zero bitted disc. When we find it, I'll apply tension with the pick, and then the only at that point, theoretically, the only disc unpicked will be disc number one. I'll use the tensioner to pick him. So, done that a couple times before. Let's see if we can make it happen on this little guy. All right, there's the first, the bottom disc, and he's free floating. Finder. I think we got him. He's moving free. Whoa, I think I fell off of him. There we go. Hmm, that may be the tensioning disc. I believe he's zero bitted. Okay, that's zero bitted. So let's try to pick the t the other two. I believe that's the gate. That is a gate. I got a little click off of him, and the last one was free floating. I believe that's the gate. So let's just double check. That feels like a nice wide gate. That one I'm not so sure about. Yep, that's a nice wide gate. That's definitely a gate. This one is zero bitted. Oh. Might have overdone it on that. Actually, that would be the second disc, because the first disc is the one I'm tensioning off of. Let me just double check him. He's kind of crunching around there. I believe that's it. All right, let's go back to the third disc down, which was zero bitted, which was him. I'm going to apply tension with my pick. Now I'm going to counter-rotate with my tensioner and try to pick disc number one without dropping everything. And I think we got it. There we go. All right, let's take a look at this guy for a second just to find out. Okay, we definitely have a locking lug here, and there's definitely a locking lug there. Let's find out. First, let's get the keys out of here. Let me zoom out, let's get a little bit wider frame here. 
the keys go? There we go. They clipped on here. Okay. Let's see what these guys look like. All right. Not bad. All right. So when we get in there. I'm not seeing anything moving here. So that would be open. What are these guys talking about? Okay, when that is rolled over, okay, that, that is spring-loaded. That one is also spring-loaded. So when it's locked, let's see if they're still spring-loaded. No, they're not. Definitely mechanical block and definitely a mechanical block. So I don't know what these guys are talking about in some of the reviews. This is definitely locked on both sides of this half inch hardened steel. Now some of the reviews also said it's easy to cut through this and some guys even included some pictures of their bike laying there with a piece of the shackle missing. But as far as I can tell, it's not going to fall out. So they might have had a different version of this lock. Maybe this is the upgraded crypto lock the uh, the mini 7 new you so it's not going to fall apart anyway guys appreciate your time stay safe stay legal each of these videos takes four to six hours to record edit and publish so i'd really appreciate it if you show your support by subscribing and clicking on the like button thanks guys